Good day mga kabaro, this is Chip Makinista. This video is about how to discharge sludge for manual purifiers. Number 1. Switch off leakage monitor alarm. Number 2. Open the oil bypass bulb or the recirculation bulb. Number 3. Close oil inlet bulb or purifier. Number 4. Fill the measuring hopper with a specified quantity of pure water. For this type of purifier, fill with pure water from 0.8 to 1.2 liters. The inside surface of the measuring hopper has a mark to show the necessary quantity. Then open the globe bulb to refill the bowl with supply of replacement water. When the repeal is completed, always make sure to close the globe bulb. Number 5. Open the bulb to supply the operating water for opening the bulb for 2 seconds so that the replacement water inside the bulb is discharged. Confirm the discharge operation by the increase of current reading of the motor or the discharge sound. When the discharge is completed, close the bulb B1 and open the solenoid bulb SB2 for 20 to 30 seconds to supply the operating water for closing the bowl. Next, refill again the bowl with a specified quantity of pure water using the hopper for supply of sealing water. And when the refill is completed, always make sure that the glow bulb is closed. Number 5. Open the flow control bulb. Then close the bypass bulb. Regulate and adjust the feed rate for better purification. In order to adjust feed rate, regulate flow control or inlet bulb to the purifier. In order to adjust pressure level, throttle the outlet bulb of the purifier. The pressure adjustment LED on top of the multi-monitor starts flashing when it is plus or minus 15% of the set pressure and changes to continuous lighting when it is within plus or minus 3%. After the feeding, make sure that there is no oil leaks out in the sludge outlet side and the heavy liquid outlet side. When the temperature of feed liquid being fed is stabilized, check once again that the light liquid pressure is within 15% of the level present in the multi-monitor. Readjust the pressure if necessary while watching the pressure adjustment LED. Lastly, Switch on the leakage monitor alarm. And that completes the procedure mga kabaro until next time.